Hi. Can you guess where I am right now? I'm at the world, not world famous, but I guess across Japan famous, Shirahama Beach in Wakayama. And happy belated birthday to me, by the way. Yes, it was my birthday yesterday. I turned 32. Do I look 32 though? No, I don't. <laughs> So yeah, happy belated birthday to me. So today is July 16th. It's a public holiday in Japan and surprisingly the beach isn't that crowded. I'm so happy for that fact. So I'm just gonna get my tan on and then I'm gonna hop in the ocean. I'm gonna take a nap and all these things. It's not too hot. In fact, Shirahama is cooler, cooler than Kainan is okay. right now. Kainan is 35 degrees Celsius, which is blazing hot. And I can't survive there throughout the whole summer. So I'll be making an escape somewhere very special soon. But for now, yes, I am enjoying life at the beach. <laughs> and look, isn't it beautiful? White sand from Australia. <laughs> okay, yeah, bye. guys it's one of those flying in water people things let me zoom I wonder if he's gonna do he was doing some tricks before Ooh, he's like Jesus that's so blasphemous I know I know but it's cool this is cool Wow out here in Shirahama three hours later so I had a nice little time as you can see at Shirahama Beach but now I'm heading to Sandan Becky which is a cliff, a cliff. And also there's a cave. I don't know if I'm gonna do the cave because it's too friggin' hot. It's way too hot. But yeah, it was so easy to get from Shirahama, Sta Shima Shirahama Station to Shirahama Beach and then from Shirahama Beach to Sandanbeki, so easy. So I'm gonna show you the beautiful view from here. And my recommendation is to always go to the Tourist Information Center because they gave me this wonderful map with time tape timetable and information guide and that really helped me this trip because every other trip I've come here I've tried to battle with the bus schedule and stupid me just go to the tourist information center and you'll be fine I'm wearing many colors so here we go let's go see this beautiful view it's kind of a hazy day but you know you gotta make do with what you got I don't know if the cliff is over this side or if that's the that's the cliff <laughs> over here looks pretty cool too let's oh get oh my god this is so beautiful oh wow sugoi wow that's all i can say wow <laughs> wakayama is so gorgeous wow look at this isn't this the most gorgeous view ever wow i wonder how many people have jumped from there why do I think about things like that? Uh, Sandanbeki Cave is actually famous for pirates, Japanese pirates, so... <laughs> Just like Jamaica, which is famous for pirates. So good. Yeah.
Oh, I want to go swimming in that so much. Oh my god. It's so beautiful. It's so beautiful. This is a shrine area with beautiful lanterns and the deities. They're over there. I don't want to film them too much. Um, the cave is pretty small. <laughs> it's not as big as the one in Okayama. O Okinawa, sorry. The cave I went to in Okinawa, that was much bigger. And entrance fee is the same cost and you're really not getting that much. So, I think they need to you know, reduce the cost of this cave. It really should only be 500 in ad admission fee, but whatever, I got duped. It's really nice, however, and it's cool on the ground because they said it was like 12 meters on the ground. And you get to learn about Kumano and some, <laughs> some pirates, some pirates and warships. I can't believe they had pirates in Wakayama. We have a cockfight going on here. It's really interesting, but yeah, they need to reduce the admissions fee. It's beautiful though, it's really, really beautiful. Feel free to come in. Sure, why not? <laughs> Let's go right in. So I guess this is like Blair Witch Project. This is the, I don't know what it would have been like. We have a little stove, you know? I'm just trying not to trip because it's really slippery and I'm wearing sandals. Can you see my sandals? I'm wearing sandals. Ooh, spooky. What? I don't know. What is this? What? What? What is, what is this? I don't know. Anyways, let me be careful. Okay, so I'm teaching you stuff today. Uh-huh, uh-huh. So you're like a whale. So it's called Shio Fuki. Shio Fuki. Fuki. Blue Hole Rock. All right, let's see if we can find it. Oh, there it is over there. Oh, there's a little blue hole. <laughs> These waves are so loud. I'm like terrified that I'll drop my camera in here. So I need to move along. Whoa. So that was the end of my little trip to Shirohama for my birthday weekend, holiday weekend. So till next time, bye!